Hey, uh, how's it going, guys? Uh, I'm back again, obviously, uh, because, well, I have to do something with my life when I have quit yet another job. Uh, I don't think that's, like, uncommon these days. Uh, most people are pretty dissatisfied with, uh, the way the world works and the fact that no matter what you do, you kind of are, like, stuck in a position at a certain point, you know what I mean? Like, uh, they tell you to try hard as a child and everything else like that, and it can't be stressed enough that you really should, because, like, if not, you're pigeonholed into, like, wherever society wants to put you, which is usually some bullcrap factory where you're gonna work till you die because Social Security doesn't work for us anymore. Like, I'm t in my 20s, you know, like, I'm not gonna ever get Social Security. I'm gonna literally work myself to death in a factory if I, like, continue to not have nothing, no prospects, you know, and what with the education system the way it is, like, it's too expensive, you know, like, even if I go to a, a community college, I either don't have enough time or I don't have a way to pay rent, you know, and it's just like, yeah, I, I figure, well, I don't want to be involved in that system, so I keep quitting my job, you know, because I'm just like, I can't sit there and play into a system that don't work. Why would I, you know? Uh, I lived in the woods for a while, and I can't help but think that I was happier there, you know, than punching a time clock, doing something I hate to make barely enough to survive. Like, oh, I got enough money to go get some McDonald's, you know what I'm saying? Like... Or I can deny myself that and invest in some dividend stock so when I'm 80 years old, I have enough to make maybe a thousand dollars a month on dividends, you know, <laughs> which isn't even enough to live. It's just like, it's a, an idiotic and broken system and I just can't, I can't, just, I can't do that. I'd rather die at 50 in, in the woods, you know, because I broke my leg or something like that, you know. So that's why I'm doing this, you know, uh, making videos and whatever else so I can try and create this uh, sustainable source of income because at this point in our reality we have like not many options as a youth, you know, and uh, pretty, uh, pretty stuck. I think that's most people's consensus, like the great resonation happened for a reason. The world's finally hit the point where we're in the generation of rebellion um yeah it's uh they say that for the four generation cycle you know there's people who are trying to establish the system and then you get comfortable in the system as the next generation and then the generation after that starts to be uncomfortable with the situation again they start to realize that it's not it's obviously not perfect and not working and then we get to the next generation who's like yeah, we need to change this broke system again because it's just not working for people. And uh, I'm happy to be a part of the rebellious one, you know what I mean? Like where I'm not going to just continue to go with the status quo because I know it doesn't work and I'm just, I'm not willing to, not willing to play into that system, you know? I'd rather die. <laughs> I think that, like, that's a... Uh, a relatively common thing now you know like no one wants to work for nothing their whole life to have almost nothing to show for it you know uh, humans weren't meant to to live like that uh, it's not like in the 1800s where you know you know you work for yourself a little bit you know you had your farm or whatever else you know and you know you were working for yourself to to have what you wanted, you know, and there was limited things then even at that point to, to have, so it's like uh, now there's all these accessible things you, you can have, but because you're pigeonholed one reason or another, you're just stuck there and you're never going to have those things, you know. Obviously, if you get an education, you start out young and whatever else, you have these talents or develop these skills you know you're gonna do okay probably 
to some extent, but you're still never going to be able to do the things that you probably really want to. And uh, that's a sad fact of the world we live in these days. And I, I just, uh, I don't know, I'm not satisfied. I'm grateful to be alive and stuff. I love living, but like, uh, and I'm grateful for a lot of stuff, but I, I can't help but feel that like literally living in the woods would be just as, just as meaningful as the life I'm living. And then I want to be giving the commodity of my time to someone else, you know, that doesn't value it like I do by any means, you know, like to them, I'm just a quantifiable number in a system for them to do better for themselves. And that's just not cool with me, man, you know, fuck that.